three blind mice, three blind mice. See how they run, see how they run. They all ran after the farmer's wife who cut off their tails with a carving knife. Did you ever see such a thing as your life as three blind mice? Apparently these three blind mice were actually Protestants and it was Queen Mary, Bloody Mary, who were chasing them down. So basically Queen Mary was the farmer's wife. However, she didn't chop off their heads with a carving knife or their tails. She actually burnt them at the stake. Did you ever see such a thing in your life as three burnt men? Rock by baby in the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. When the bell breaks, the cradle will fall and down will come baby, cradle and all. One of my favourite ones I found out about this one was it was in America. A pilgrim saw a Native American hanging up baskets from a tree and so when the wind blew, the cradles did rock. Ring around a rosy, a pocket full of posy. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. Well, unfortunately, this one does have a bit of a sinister past. As a lot of you probably already know, it is about the plague. In 1665, all fall down. That was about a quarter of the population of London did fall down. The ring a ring of roses was the rash that was caused by the plague. And the pocket full of posies was a little sachet that everybody seemed to keep in their pockets so they could smell it to mask the smell, which was everywhere. Mary, Mary, quite contrary, how does your garden grow? With silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row. Bloody Mary crops up again. This time they say it was about, well, actually the same as last time, about killing Protestants, her favorite hobby. The silver bells and cockle shells, well, they were instruments of torture. And the pretty maids, that was the guillotine, the maiden. London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Now there are two things here. One, they say it's because during Viking times when they burnt the bridge down. Number two, they said it was the downfall of Anne Boleyn, who was one of Henry VIII's wives. Not sure which. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after. So this was probably originated in France where King Louis was Jack and Marie Antoinette was Jill. Basically, Jack, or King Louis, lost his crown and Jill, Marie Antoinette, came tumbling after in the reign of terror, which was the French Revolution. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall, Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. There are two options here. One, Humpty Dumpty was a popular 17th century drink made with brandy and ale, which might make you fall off a wall. Or it was a cannon that was placed on a wall during the English Civil War. It fell once when it was hit and unfortunately they couldn't fix it. This is Mister. He's a very snuggly cat. 